The HMI demonstration has camera systems in it. This could be a technology that could be used to transition as we move towards piloted vehicles or automatic controlled vehicles. What we're doing is using eye tracking to take eye gaze information and head position information and feed that into the instrument cluster and the center stack display. So we're using it to control the human machine interface in the vehicle. The primary focus right now is to minimize the eye movement from the road so that you're keeping your eyes on the road and your hands on the wheel. We put the controls in the steering wheel and as we look at the items on the screens we can select it with our eyes and make a quick selection on a steering wheel control and get fast response time. By looking at these different icons in here I can move into for example an iPod selection and select a different song from an iPod. I can go back to the home screen. I can take a look at my map, see where I'm at on a destination. I can zoom in on that map or zoom out to a new location by looking at it. I can go back in, check my climate control, adjust temperature. Most of the eye tracking systems in the past have been primarily safety oriented. This is using it as an HMI control, so we could add safety features to it later, but the technologies like eye tracking coming into play, several companies are showing it like, you know, for game control and things. It's a very fast response time. And so we're seeing those types of new user interfaces come in. The cost of cameras are getting cheaper. It's easier to integrate them now. They're getting smaller. And so we see that that is where the user interface uh, opportunity is moving in that kind of direction to add those new capabilities. There's going to be a movement over time. And one of the things we see is that we're going to have to know, is the driver ready to take control if the vehicle's in control? So we see a lot of these different technologies that we're trying to incorporate on that roadmap as we move forward to uh, these visions of autonomous driving.